After a 15 year break, the Grazer Altstadt Criterium was finally back. The elite man raced 60 laps over a 980 meter city course with a cobblestone climb. There were big names, such as Jerome Thomas, Gregor Mühlberger, Jan Tratnik and Marco Haller at the start, just to name some. At the same time, the Austrian champs in quit racing took place and with that came a strong rider field. In the first laps, the field stayed together, but as the prime sprints came closer, riders tried to get in a breakaway. But the peloton was always in control of the escape groups and brought them back in a controlled manner. In between, the pace got very fast and it looked as if the peloton would split and the field was completely single filed. There were many small gaps, but the pace eased up a bit and all came back together. Gerard Thomas was in the peloton for most of the race and didn't participate in any moves and saved energy. He left gaps to the riders in front of him before corners and closed them by carrying more speed through them. That's how you avoid crashes and touching wheels, without having to spend more energy. Towards the end of the race Thomas attacked and some riders tried to join him, but only Jan Tratnik was able to follow in the final laps of the race. They took the sprint to the line and Thomas won, but the main group wasn't far behind and it came down to a bunch sprint for third place and the title of the Austrian quit racing champion. So the final results, Thomas won, Tratnik got second and Haller took third in a bunch sprint. Haller also got Austrian quit racing champion. After the race, Thomas said, it was a race that was a lot of fun, especially when you win it. At times it was slippery and uneven, but that's what makes a race like this special. The mood was terrific, almost like on the Champs-Élysées, loud and fast. He also said that he would love to come back next year. That's it, thanks for watching, like and subscribe and see you in the next video.